It's time for the Phil Ferguson Show. With me today, I have John Fallis, who just put out a movie, well, May, uh, called Leaving God. John, how are you? I'm terrific, Um, Phil. Found it very fun to watch. It's well done, well edited. Uh, John, I don't want to be too flattering, but this was pretty good. Hollywood International Film Festival. You apparently were the winner of that. Is it, or is there a sub subcategory? There, or there, there are multiple winners. It, it's the uh, Hollywood right International Independent Documentary. Did you grow up with religion, and how did that work out? Yeah, I grew up as a Catholic. Went to church on Sundays with my parents until I hit about uh, high school age, I guess, and then got a little bit more rebellious and challenged going to church on Sunday. And I'm sure there were a few squabbles about that until they finally acquiesced. And then they stopped going to church, which was interesting. So you have leaving God. So at some point you, you know, you were confused, you were frustrated, you were conflicted because of the contradictions. Um, You're not Catholic now though, are you? No, no. And you know, I I just want to make sure your viewers understand this film is not all about me because then it really would be a very boring film, (laughs) (laughs) right? Um, Even though uh, part of it includes my journey uh, seeking the truth. My main motivation for making the film was uh, just paying attention to the shifting tides in, in America around the idea of uh, traditional religion and God. And uh, the film really addresses that by pointing out that for the first time, uh, based on recent research that's been done, that for the first time in America, the largest religious group in America is the non-believers or, or non-traditional religious people. And to me, that that was a pretty uh, significant yes. uh, shift, right? Because people who say they don't subscribe to any particular religion. Not that long ago, that was between 5 and 7% of people in America. And uh, just in the past, I think, 20 or 30 years, that has now become the largest group at 25%. So, so that's, that was a significant uh, shift. And then, of course, by by doing the research, uh, I found out that it's not only uh, people like me and you and maybe some of the listeners who have uh, changed their traditional religious beliefs, but now more and more priests and ministers are, quote, coming out of the closet as non-believers, And that, to me, just kind of blew my mind. And so I, I talk about that in the film as well. And of course, people under 30 and definitely under 25 years of age, that number of non-religious is significantly higher even for them. Correct. When more younger people are kind of leading this shift to non-belief, that means that uh, it's not a great time to be in the church business. <laughs> yeah, and, and a big contributing factor to this, Phil, as I mentioned in my film, is the internet. Yes, I agree. I, I mean, since the mid '90s, that's if you look at the uh, the, the bar graphs of uh, people leaving religion and changing their attitudes about religion and God, it, it really parallels almost identically with the growth of internet use beginning in the mid '90s. So uh, that's why I thought uh, this this film would be interesting as it kind of explores. Of the shifting trend, why it's happening. And, and again, as I mentioned, the fact that now more and more priests and ministers are coming out, which is a, there could be a great documentary just on that subject alone. You know, right now it's really scary uh, for these, these, these men and I guess women who are clergy members uh, to uh, identify themselves as someone who no longer believes. I mean, these people get death threats from, you know, their hardcore uh, congregations. So, I mean, it's a really interesting um, topic to explore. And I only, I only touch on it a little bit. In case we missed it or you missed it earlier by listening, the title of the film is called Leaving God. It's on uh, Vimeo. And uh, can you, would you be willing to go to some conferences and show the film and talk about it 
um, around the country. Absolutely. But John, if someone wants to do this, how do they reach you? They can email me at john at bigideavideo.biz. That's dot B-I-Z, bigideavideo.biz. Well, John, thank you so much for, A, making this movie. I really enjoyed it, watching it twice. I appreciate the movie. I appreciate the conversations that we've had. And uh, I appreciate you taking time out of your busy day to come on The Phil Ferguson Show. Oh, thank you.